This here's Jim Bob. This here's Clay. And we are the Whiskey Drinkers. That's right. And we're back with another motherfucking whiskey uh, taste test. Taste test, array. Well, so what we got. Let's get right to it. You ready? Yep. Clem McGregor. Wow. Oh, here we go. Clem McGregor. Clem McGregor Scotch. Now, is that an English name? Damn, my nose is still issue, Jim. Well, just hold on. Some Pull them job. boogers out of there. I can't get a hold of the damn hair. You're going to have to get them needle nose pliers up in there. It's hey. all that cocaine you've been doing. I don't do cocaine, kids. Um, well, this right here is a blended Scotch whiskey. Now right. you you can go out there and you can spend eight hundred dollars on a bottle of Scotch like a dumb fucking That's idiot. Right. Now get that Johnny Walker. Uh, uh, yeah. What the hell was it? Uh, blue, blue label, silver label. I think gold it, label, the blue label is like three hundred dollars, two hundred dollars. It even goes higher than that. Yeah, and we ain't pissing around with that. We're not so. doing that shit. So we got us. How much was this? Um, about twenty bucks. About twenty something. This is about twenty dollars Scotch right here. So. uh you know, and it has a, a legitimate name, Clan McGregor. 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 Yeah, and uh, I imagine that's the Clan. Clan McGregor of the Clan McGregors. Yeah, see? He's half Irish. Yeah, it's uh, from Braveheart. Oh, of. this isn't Irish, this is Scottish. Scottish. Well, uh, this is distilled and aged, blended in Scotland. Um, a blend of our finest malt and grain whiskeys, complex, sweet, and mellow flavor. Wow. Wow. Now, you don't have to drive to Scotland to get this. You can pick it up at almost any seat store. Oh, yeah. And if yeah. they ain't got it, I'm sure they can order it for you. Oh, yeah. Um, let's see. There's the same thing. Else. Okay, let me read this here. Clan McGregor blend scotch, uh, blended scotch whiskey combines the qualities of exceptional taste and fine flavor, which are derived from the expert blending of specially selected scotch whiskeys of the finest quality it is an achievement of perfection distilled by skilled craftsmen and aged for 36 months to create a character of smoothness and taste that is unmatched oh you get it yeah God damn a little nap Nats. flying around well um they're hopping this it's like up. a right it's nap dick for a 20 dollar scotch you're sure hyping that up and talking the hell out of it it now, looks it looks impressive. Like it, does. it looks like it kind of looks like a tall beer. It does. Just by the label, it it's like tall boy. It does. Now we're a big fan of that. It Glenn, don't look like a tall. Glenn Levitt's. Yeah, that's right. Glenn Levitt's or whatever. Glenn Levitt. So we're, let's, we're you know we can compare it to that and see how this stands up to that's the right. Glenn Levitt's. Crack open. Uh, yep. You guys ready? All right. This sounds it's legit. Sealed. Yep. How's she smell? It doesn't smell in there. Oh, it doesn't there. Oh, oh, yes, it does. I love me some scotch. Now, that Ooh. smells like it's going to kick you right in the boo-boo. Right in the asshole. That's right. All right, so we should, we, should I pour this little bitch up? Yeah, I guess so. I mean, I have all them years of bartending experience. Look at that. Looks nice and clear. Oh, I'm excited about this. I know you are. Oh, man. All right. Cheers to you. Here's to uh, all of our and, misadventures. As, as they say in Scotland, salut. Salute. Got to hold my lip. Okay. Uh, wow. Uh, <laughs> wow. Um, uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now I have to say, um, that doesn't really stand up to Glenn Levitt's. No, but it's not bad. It's not bad. It's not bad at all. It's not bad, but damn, um, wow, guys. <laughs> damn. It's not, it's not bad. I mean, you know, the whole point is this shit will fuck you up, and that's why we're in this. <clears throat> it's what we're doing this for. Um, but if you want a good scotch, you might want to spend a couple extra bucks for the Glenn Levitt's. Yeah. I mean, this, uh, this ain't bad. For, that's there's a fifth, I believe. <clears throat> now to get a fifth of Glen Levitt, you're talking uh, you're talking some money. Most of the time we get them, we get them in the pints because they're a little bit cheaper. Yep. Depends on the age too. I think it's uh, 17 years aged. Yeah. And the uh, pint is uh, let's say it's around 35 bucks. Damn. So you're getting a little bit less alcohol, I think. Well, you know, we have a damn bottle. Uh, we did. We must have ran. Uh, no, I think we drank it all. Pick up some more. Well. Oh, 
Yeah. It, it, you're paying a little bit more, but you're getting a lot better quality. This is not bad, though. Yeah, I mean, you can always hold your nose and pretend like it's Glenn Levitz and Good. save the money. Um, hmm. What, what do I'm you not a big scotch fan. I do like me some good scotch. I'm going to say, uh, hmm. I'll give it three out of five. <laughs> wow. I don't think it's bad. That is fucking crazy. I was going to give it a three out of five, too. <clears throat> I'm not even just copying off you. I was really thinking that. I thought I was gonna be all clever. It's not, it really, it's not bad. It's not bad, but it's not the best. No, it's not. It's definitely no. Like now, if you get like the thirty-five year age, Glenn yep. Levitt, you're talking eighty some, hundred and some bucks. And there's something that they do to them. Um, they siphon them through something a hundred, a whole bunch of times. Yeah, through like seventy-two virgins or something. Something like that. Like that. This one's probably only been through one virgin. Probably. And the other ones have been through like twelve virgins. How the hell do they do that? I don't know, but after a few drinks. You could probably drink this right down. That's a good point. Once you start to numb your taste buds and stuff, that's probably going down like water. It's already tasting better in my mind. <laughs> As I said. Yeah, the way my eyes are seeing right now, because I'm seeing two cameras, <clears throat> I'm thinking a couple more drinks of that, and it's going to be like drinking uh, Gatorade. Yeah, or good, or that Spiked Mountain Dew. That that we spiked, had. spiked Mountain wow. Dew is pretty damn good. We had some of that earlier. Thank you, Taco Bell. Yeah, well, we thought that it was spiked with alcohol. Mm, that's we, why we got it. We brought it home. It wasn't, and then we spiked it with our own alcohol, and it was a lot better. That's right. We thought it was funny they didn't cart us at the drive-thru. Yeah. It was a lot, but. Yeah. All right, well, that's been Clay McGregor wow. Scotch right there. Well, I, we didn't do this on the last one, but this one makes it right up here. Right. Well, we'll put it right, right here. Right inside the apple. Oh, yeah. Because that apple is pretty good. Oh, yeah. But anyway, this is a Clay McGregor. It's not bad. I'm starting to feel shitty, so. I'm starting to feel drunk. And I mean shitty in a good way, as in yes, like right. shit face, so. All right. Well, until next time, we'll see you later. See you later. All right.